our number one goal will be to significantly increase test scores. Tom Horn wasting no time identifying his top priorities as superintendent, raising low test scores and more student discipline. We need a return to traditional discipline in our schools. A Department of Education spokesperson confirmed to Arizona's family that traditional discipline means timeouts and possible principal visits or suspensions, not any form of physical punishment. But the way it was phrased concerns Arizona Education Association President Marisol Garcia. The superintendent might be a little out of touch of what's happening in our schools. Garcia says there are bigger priorities. Everything from smaller class sizes to resources to the amount of adults in the classrooms to health and safety issues. All of those things are more important to Arizona educators, to students and families. Horn already announcing new staff. One of those, character education program leader Mila McCall, one of his responsibilities is to promote positive traits like respect and compassion. But some people are concerned with his appointment after he posted multiple images from the right-leaning group Patriot Life over the last year, including a picture of President Joe Biden that says, let's go, Brandon. It's unfortunate that any state employee would feel that it was, that it was um, okay to bring their political views into state work. In a statement to Arizona's family, Department of Education spokesperson Doug Nick says every person has political viewpoints and opinions. It doesn't mean they can't do their jobs well. Like every citizen, Mila McCall is guaranteed the First Amendment right to express his personal views. But Garcia says it's a school leader's job to not mix education and politics. Educators do not post things like that. Um, they, they, they're not allowed to because um, they're employees. We did attempt to speak with McCall directly about these Facebook posts, but he was not made available to us at this time. Live in Phoenix, Elliot Polikoff, Arizona's family.